Hey guys, I know I haven't uploaded a video in quite a while, but with the release of Mo Navy Tech after the two year wait, I'm absolutely hyped to jump back into this. So this video will be going over sailing and it'll be in a three part series regarding economy and warfare. Uh, do keep in mind that all of these are subject to change due to the constant updating that you know Mo is in right now due to this release. So yeah, quick, uh, quick disclaimer there. But if this video performs well enough, I'll you know release those videos quite quickly after this one. So keep in touch. So now that we've spawned on our ship, it's time to go over the very basics of sailing. So if you hold V like I'm doing here, you can set your sails to half sails, full sails, or no sails. Now I'm gonna set it to full sails here in order to demonstrate what it's like. So your sails will come down and you will be uh, gaining speed as you're, you know, being pushed by the wind. So it gives a command like that, and there's a short cooldown period where you can uh, give orders. Now I can set no sails, and my sails retract. Uh, this will help you break when you're turning into port, as anchors haven't actually been fully fledged out yet. Now next to one of the most important parts of sailing, the helm. As you can see, I hold E and my rudder's there, it's a midship currently, which is the default state. So if I want to go larboard, I'll have to hold D and it'll automatically, you know, set to that position. And I'll do the same if I want to go starboard. So this will dictate where you want to turn and it's incredibly key in maneuvering your ship and sailing in general. I cannot stress how important this is guys, you gotta watch your helm, because if it's set on starboard and no one's watching it, you guys are probably gonna turn a pretty hard right. Which actually brings us to our next topic, bracing your masts and your sails really. So. Um, you can either go to the left or the right of the ship and turn it to up to four points. As you can see, I'm doing here. I'm turning this up to four points larboard. And now I'm demonstrating uh, myself pulling the sprint sails to starboard. So I'm doing this to four points. But uh, like I said again, you want to be catching the wind, which moves on, which moves us on to our next topic. Um, actually adjusting your sails to the wind. So now I'm back at the drawing board here. And I'm going to teach you guys how to go with the wind here, um, as this is critical for understanding Monet. In fact, I mean, I was stuck on this for a while. Like, I had to get my my friend to help me drive the ship because I was so, you know, terrible at it. But now I'm going to teach you how to do it. So, let's begin. So, let's start with some general terminology here. We have starboard, larboard, and a midship. With starboard being to the right of the ship, larboard to the left, and a midship to the middle. A hard larboard turn would be four points to the left, and a hard uh, starboard would be uh, four points to the right, um, demonstrated here. You can also help uh, by turning your sails, so that's one thing. Next, we have you know general rules with the wind. So you, the general rule is to sail along with the wind, so you're riding off of it. Sailing with the wind, good on the left, and sailing to reduce drag is also good. Now, what not to do? is to go against the wind. Why? Slow speed, slow turn, and extremely vulnerable. Therefore, you should never do this. Well, that concludes uh, my tutorial for Mo Sailing. Um, if you really like this video, I'll probably do one about economy pretty soon. So stay tuned for that. Uh, like, subscribe, like I said at the start. So now, I wish all of you happy sailing, happy trading, and happy hunting. Alright, see you guys.